Kodesh Yamaha Marine in Hanover, Pennsylvania. Northeast's largest express dealer and one of the largest express dealers in the nation. I'm Andy, press guy here at FNS. If you contact us, more than likely you'll be speaking with me to do a walkthrough of an express H24 Bay. We just got this in a couple weeks ago. Uh, it is for sale at this particular moment. Um, it is a 24 foot H series bay model with Yamaha's 250 SHO. Also has the extreme trailer package, which has the 18 inch rims, heavy duty fenders with matching C deck pads on the inside of the fenders, which is just kind of hard to see that there. Flush mounted LED tail lights and backup lights and ratchet tie downs. That's all part of the Extreme Trailer Package. Like all Expresses, the H24 has a pad hull. And what that means is at the very back bottom of the hull, there is a pad. And what that, that pad is about 15 inches wide and roughly two feet long. And when the boat, with a performance pad hull like this, when the boat's running wide open, with the motor trimmed all the way out. The only thing that's in the water is that pad. So that makes the boat go faster and ride better because there's very little of the boat actually in the water. Express has quite a reputation for ride and handling. And that's just one reason that makes them have that reputation. Along with the rest of the hull design, you'll take notice to the very aggressive reverse chines and the steps of the hull. These boats turn on a dime and rival many fiberglass boats in the industry. The 24 foot H Bay is the longest bay boat that Express makes. In the H series, it's their flagship. With a 250 SHO, it's about a 60 mile an hour boat, low 60s, um, a little bit faster depending on the day and the conditions and whatnot but it really accelerates and hole shots exceptionally well with that 250 on it. Like all the Expresses, they come standard with spray and liners. You can see the spray and liner, which is right here. And it's sprayed everywhere, on top of every deck, underneath every hatch, basically everyone, everywhere in the boat. It's little things like that that makes these boats again ride and handle so well it's just all these little things that add up here's an example of how the hull is put together this is the bottom of the boat then you'll see the cross members it slots these cross members throughout and then the floor and then they spray and foam in between the floor and the bottom of the boat in the cross members. Makes for a very quiet ride, a very good ride. Of course, all the Expresses are complete welded boats. Everything's completely welded in the boat, including the floors. There's a lot of competitors that rivet even the floors in. That's not with Express. Everything's completely welded together. This is the charcoal color. Express calls it charcoal. I call it black with the silver stripes. Matching silver console. We upgraded this boat to a Riptide Tarova 80 pound iPod Link trolling motor. Upgrade most of our bay boats to the link motors and then link them to the console fish finder. And then also, too, a lot of people then opt to afterwards install even additional fish finder up front. We do a lot of that. This particular boat doesn't come with it, but we'd be glad to add it. I have Helix 12s and Helix 9 Humminbirds in stock to match up with the link motor. We also get every Express Bay Boat with the Minn Kota Quick Disconnect Bracket and Heavy Duty Minn Kota Trolling Motor Plug.
C deck throughout. This is the C deck with gray and black inlays. C deck's very popular. Most expresses are sold with it. It's very nice to walk on, easy to clean. Other upgrades, ladder. 10 inch hydraulic jack plate, which is a must on a boat like this. It makes performance better and also just even little things like load and unload and off the trailer. Of course, shallow water capability is considerably better. I apologize for the noise. We live out here in the country and uh, one of the farmers just went by, one of the tractors. Also, this boat was ordered with the Extreme Marsh Package. So with the Extreme Marsh Package, a hydraulic jack plate is included, but then I upgrade to the 10 inch hydraulic jack plate. Also with the Extreme Marsh Package, everything in stainless. Steering wheel, grab handle, Rod holders. The seat, the leaning post seat then comes with backrest and footrest. Cup holders are stainless. Also included with the Stream Marsh package, you get upgraded stainless steel switches in the dash. And the bait well is recirced as well. So a recirculated bait well. So you have a bait well up front, which is here. And then also a live well in the rear, which is here. Also the Extreme Marsh package, it comes with a built-in charger for the trolling motor batteries, which are in the console. And then a different type of fuse panel in the console with LED lights. It makes it a little easier to see things with any potential problems. Like all express boats here at FNS, we go through and PDI things very thoroughly. It takes a couple days for us to go through and repair the things that need to be repaired from the factory, which that's just part of boats today in, in the industry. And then we also go water test every boat before you receive it, because there's certain things that we can only test in the water, uh, like live well leaks and hull leaks and that type of thing. And we go to the water and test those things before you get them. And also with the Extreme Marsh package, you get trim gauge, and water pressure gauge. And of course you take note to the tachometer with the hour meter built in. This boat was upgraded to a Helix 9 side imaging, which again is linked to the trolling motor up front. Other upgrades, wet sounds stereo system, the four speakers, interior light kit, which there are lights throughout all the interior compartments one on either side of the console which is right here and the, the live wells are lit another upgrade is washdown pump so we have a high pressure washdown pump with the switches here the pump is at the back of the boat which pumps in from the lake or river or whatnot of course so you can wash down the interior of your boat that's all back here with the 40 gallon fuel tank. Jump seats. One jump seat on each side of the leaning post. And then underneath each jump seat is a cooler with a drain which is here. The blue hose you see in there is for the washdown pump. So 
See the speakers on the side of the console. Six cleats throughout, three on each side. Another upgrade with this particular boat is a storage box just in front of the front deck. It has a little bit of additional storage and it kind of makes it a nice step as well. Rod storage, which is here. And the rod storage goes all the way up underneath the front deck. So that's one huge storage area which is connected to this storage area as well. Take note to the spray and liner throughout underneath every hatch and basically everywhere. Upgraded Euro seats, which is a little bit more comfortable seat that is larger, wider, more comfortable. So there's quite a few upgrades with this particular boat. If also you want to do upgrades with shallow water anchors and whatnot, we do a lot of that in-house. We do a lot of uh, electronics installs. We welcome that. We do lots of it. I appreciate you watching, and feel free to contact me. You'll see our info at the bottom of the screen. Let me know if you have any questions.